Hello, welcome to the Marching Art Show, the cybersecurity show. We all have phones, right? The majority of us have phones and technology becomes more advanced by the day. There are apps that can literally turn your phone into a super hacking computer. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about those apps in detail. So without further ado, let's get right into it. We're going dark. We have the Haven hacking app, right? Haven hacking app. So Haven is an open source Android application developed by Edward Snowden in collaboration with the Guardian Project and Freedom of the Press Foundation. It is designed to transform any Android phone into a surveillance system that can monitor physical spaces for unexpected guests and intruders. The app utilizes the phone's sensors such as the camera, microphone, accelerometer, and light detector to detect motion, sound, vibration, and light changes. Now, let's get into a little bit more of what are the key features of Haven. So we talked about the surveillance capabilities, right? Haven can detect movement, sound, vibration, and changes in light using the phone sensors. It is particularly useful for guarding against evil made attacks where physical access to a device could compromise its securities. There's also the notifications where users can receive real-time alerts via encrypted uh, signal messages or through a Tor-based website. The app also supports SMS notifications. Now, the real use cases are Haven is intended for investigative journalists, human rights defenders, and individuals at risk of forced disappearance. It can also be used as a home or office security system or to monitor wildlife. Please take a moment right now to hit that subscribe button and the like button. If you like this video, if you appreciate it, if you like the information, please hit that subscribe button and like button. Now, in regards to installation, the app is available for download on Google Play and F-Droid. Users can also build the app from source code available on GitHub. Haven aims to provide peace of mind by leveraging smartphone, smartphone technology to create a secure monitoring system without compromising user privacy. Next, we have the NetHunter Store Hacker app. So NetHunter Store is an Android app store dedicated to security and penetration testing applications created by Offensive Security, the company behind Kali Linux. So the, you know, the key details about the NetHunter Store is it is, you know, it's basically a repository of free security related software for Android devices. It's designed as an alternative to the Google Play Store for security and hacking apps. It offers easy browsing, installation and updating of security apps on Android devices. Now, we talked about it. Now let's get into the key features, right? It provides a catalog of Android applications for penetration testing and forensics. It includes apps from the Kali NetHunter platform, which is a mobile penetration testing platform based on Kali Linux. It offers um, both a dedicated client app and a web interface for accessing the store. Now, in regards to privacy and security, because it's, it's really strong in that area, it's built on a modified version of F-Droid with enhanced privacy features. There's telemetry and crash reporting code, uh, which has, uh, you know, been completely removed to ensure user privacy. It allows proprietary applications unlike the standard F-Droid repository. Now, the availability, however, it can be installed on almost any Android device, including unrooted ones. It offers different editions. You have the NetHunter Rootless or 4, which is basically for unrooted devices. You have the NetHunter Lite for rooted devices and full NetHunter for supported devices with custom kernels. It features a wide range of security tools, including those found on Kali Linux, it includes specialized apps, for tasks like HID keyboard attacks, bad USB attacks, and evil AP mana attacks. The NetHunter store provides a centralized platform for security professionals, penetration testers, and enthusiasts to access a curated collection of security-focused Android applications. The next one we have is the Orbot Hacker app. So Orbot, it's a free proxy app that provides anonymity for Android and iOS users by routing internet traffic through the Tor network. So the key points of this hacker app is, let's start with what is Orbit or bots, right? Orbot acts as an intermediary between your mobile device and the servers used by various applications and websites. It routes your internet traffic through several relays within the Tor network, encrypting your data and hiding your IP address and physical location. Now, how Orbot works is it uses the Tor relay network to encrypt your data and route it through multiple nodes, making it difficult for anyone to intercept your connection 
or identify your online activities. It allows you to use Tor protection for all your mobile apps, not just web browsing. That's key. Orbot has a built-in VPN feature that helps users bypass firewalls and access blocked content. Now, the key features and benefits are the anonymity, right? Orbot hides your real IP address and location from websites and apps. Uh, the privacy is it protects your data from surveillance by governments, ISPs, and other third parties. We know the times that we're living in, right? There's also the access to blocked content, right? Or bot can help bypass censorship and, ac and access restricted websites. There's also dark web access. It allows you to access onion sites on the dark web from your mobile device now. Orbot is a cool tool, but there are limitations and considerations. So Orbot can significantly slow down your internet speed due to multiple relay points. So while it provides strong privacy protection, it's not foolproof against all types of attacks or surveillance, okay? So users should be aware that Orbot doesn't remove identifying information from app traffic itself, okay? Now, in regards to usage, however, Orbot is available for Android and iOS devices. It's relatively easy to set up and use with options for both basic and advanced configuration. So while Orbot can be a powerful tool for privacy and, you know, anonymity, uh, users should understand its limitations and use it in conjunction with other security practices for optimal protection. Next is the USB Cleaver Hacker app. So the USB Cleaver is a powerful Android-based hacking tool designed to extract sensitive information from Windows computers. Now, key details about this app. So the functionality, right? Let's start there. The USB Cleaver allows hackers to silently recover information from target Windows 2000 or higher computers, steal browser passwords from Firefox, Chrome, and Internet Explorer. Those are some of the heavy browsers in the industry. They have the most influence in my opinion. And then extract Wi-Fi passwords, right? gather network information, dump system information. Now, how it works is the hacker installs USB cleaver on their Android device. When the Android device is connected to a Windows PC, the app mounts the SD card. So if auto run is enabled on the PC, the app executes its payload. So the stolen, the stolen information is saved to log files on the Android device's CD card. Uh, the key features are it allows selection of specific payloads to use, okay, it, it, it does that. It runs silently without modifying the system or generating network traffic. It captures information to log files for later review. There's potential, now here are the potential uses, uses for using this, right? While USB Cleaver has legitimate uses for security research and penetration testing, it can also be misused for malicious purposes, right? Security professionals can use it to identify vulnerabili vulnerabilities, okay? Malicious actors could exploit it for data theft. There's a difference. So it's crucial to note that using USB cleaver or similar tools without explicit permission is illegal and unethical. This app should only be used on systems you own or have permission to test and in, and in accordance with applicable laws and regulations. So don't be just out here just hacking things, guys. The next one we have is the NetCut Hacker app. NetCut is a network management tool that allows users to monitor and control devices on a local area network, also known as LAN. And some of the key points of NetCut is the network scanning, right? NetCut can detect all devices connected to a Wi-Fi network, including their IP and MAC addresses. There's connection control, which it allows users to cut off or block specific devices from accessing the network. There's the bandwidth monitoring. NetCut can monitor network usage of connected devices devices. That's key. That's super key. Then there's the ARP spoofer spoofing connect uh, protection, ARP spoofing protection, ARP spoofing protection. It includes features to detect and prevent ARP spoofing attacks on its networks. Now the versions and availability NetCut is available on Windows, Mac OS, and Android platforms. The Android version requires root access to function fully. So there is a free version as well as a paid pro version with additional features. So use this responsibly, however, right? That's what I have for you today. Please take a moment to hit that subscribe button and the like button. Again, if you like this video, if you learned something new, if you appreciate this content, please hit that subscribe button and the like button. Also, let me know your opinion in the comment section below. I appreciate your viewership. Stay safe and see you on the next video.